I remember building my first like GeoCities website. There was something about like building that and just, like showing it to people and being like, hey, this is the thing that like I made. I remember creating like silly little apps that would, would do things like just like have a, a cat face that would meow at you whenever you like clicked on it. When I was a kid, I used to love mechanical toys because it was easy to pull them apart and see how they worked. When I started to work on the web, I felt that again. I felt like I was able to open it up and see how it worked. What I love about the web is how quickly it's changing and how I get to be sitting on the leading edge of it. I reckon the one thing I love the most about the web is the fact that anybody can put up a site. Anyone can just pick up a tutorial and within like 10 minutes they've got a website, something visible on screen. Having the ability to talk to someone that's on a completely different part of the world, having them like contribute to your project. Being able to just imagine something and build it. It can also be frustrating because sometimes there are tools and, and things like that that you want to use that maybe aren't available yet. You can sort of see them off there in the future, right? Maybe one browser implements them, but not all the other ones. The real frustrating experience about the web is anything that gets in the way of content. It's this massive inconsistent area of, of APIs and technologies. Everything has a catch. Like if you want service workers, you need TLS. If you want push, that's fine, but you can't have payload. If you want payload, you have to encrypt it. When a, a website says, hey, do you want to go and download our native app? That's such a bad experience because I'm already there. I'm already asking you for the content. It would be like going into a shop and having the thing like a Kit Kat in your hand and you go to the checkout and they say, hey, would you like to go to our shop in Norwich? I'm like, no, no, I'm at this shop now. When I think about the future of the web, it's always about that promise and it's not being fulfilled yet. The idea that everybody on the planet can communicate. The, the next billion users, people that are in other parts of the world that maybe don't have as good network connectivity as we do. Making things faster, making things more accessible. These are really important challenges that we're facing. Chipping away at some of the old preconceived notions. We try and listen, we try and drive conversations, and I just, it just makes my day. I'd love to see more people doing that, like just empowering other people to build awesome stuff. We're gonna be able to build apps that we've never even dreamed of before. I think it's cool to, to be living through this, this period in time right now. I think generations will like look back and be like, wow, that's like a, an inflection point for humanity when suddenly communication became global in an instant.